So we are today celebrating our four tons. We have managed to take four tons out of the landfill and uh, we've recycled all the plastics and all the papers, make sure that that food was delivered to our families here in Providence and that other food was shared within our school itself, really uh, reduced what we were putting in the landfill. So it's very important because we're the first school to be starting to do this work here in Providence and hopefully this will expand and we'll be saving even more for our, our landfill. It's really important because like without recycling or composting all of this stuff just goes into the landfill and it'll they get greenhouse gases and things that we don't want in the environment so like when it can go and become soil or food for other people it's a lot better than just throwing it in a pile. Yeah, so, so I have about um, 27 kids that worked in our program this, this semester. I'll be getting a whole new batch next semester that are going to be trained. So it'll reach a total of about 50 kids that are going to be active captains this year. Um, so we were recognizing them and making sure that they got the reward for all the hard work that they have put in this year. What you're doing is, um, is you're, you're being leaders, right? This is really about being leaders and, and you're setting the way and showing that doing the right thing is possible. And a lot of other schools are going to see that, a lot of other students are going to see that, and they're going to see the benefits of the path that you've set for them. And, and by really taking your experience and applying it to other schools in Providence and other schools in Rhode Island, it's going to keep making more and more of a difference. And that's, that's really a huge win. So I want to thank you guys. You're doing, you're doing great work. Um, you, you're setting an amazing example. And uh, it's something that really should be copied all over the state. Well, it's very important because we have climate change happening. And so our world, our planet is changing on a daily basis. And this can really help reduce the greenhouse gases and emissions in our environment and hopefully slow that climate change process.